before this video starts, I just want to let you guys know that I am doing a giveaway on this AK Slate Field Tested Condition. So, if you guys want to enter this giveaway, make sure to leave a like on this video, comment down below what is your favorite sticker from the Paris Major, and as always, make sure to join the Discord server where you will be able to go to the giveaway tab and join this giveaway. So, with all this being said, let's get back into the video. And what is up guys, The Stone here, and in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the Paris Major stickers. So, last night, they came out and they look exactly the same as the Paris Major stickers. So, in today's video, we're gonna be talking about what are some of the best stickers that you guys can be investing in this is going to be individual stickers and it's not going to be a specific sticker capsule investing strategy, but it is going to be a pure just sticker investing strategy. So teams, I think that are good investments and also stickers that look very, very nice. First, a few words about the sponsor of today's video, Skinport. Skinport is a fast, smooth, easy and secure CSGO marketplace. It has 0% buyer's fees and only a 12% seller's fees. They support many countries and many currencies. So if you're looking for a payout or a way to cash out your skins, Skinport has got your back. They are uh, the most trusted CSGO marketplace out there with a 4.9 out of 5 rating on Trustpilot with over 10,000 reviews. And on top of all of this, Skinport has one of the highest skin volumes out there with over 420,000 skins available to purchase each day. And on top of all of this, Skinport prices are absolutely cheap compared to the Steam Marketplace. For example, we can see that this AK-47 Vulcan in field tested condition is 238 euros and on the steam market it sells for 306 euros that is an absolutely huge discount so guys if you want to check out skinport please make sure to click the first link in the description or go and check the pinned comment on this video where you will find links to skinport where you can grab yourself the cheapest skins out there so with this being said thank you skinfort for sponsoring this video and let's get back to the video so the first team i have in mind is gonna be the furia hollow of course this is gonna be a very invested in sticker but nevertheless it looks absolutely amazing the light blue with a red tint as well when you move it would just look absolutely amazing on something like an AK Vulcan or an Ob Gangnir. I think that it would look very nice on some skins like that. But also it could go very well on a red line and some other stuff like that. So I think that this is going to be a very sought after sticker. So when the sale hits, if this drops a lot, maybe get it. If you want to be investing in individual stickers, the Furia Hollow would be a very nice investment. Another very unique investment is going to be the Navi sticker. So the Navi sticker is red, blue, tintish. So maybe they did it because of the Ukraine conflict. Most likely they did it because of this. But still, this it makes it have a very unique look that I don't think a lot of other Navi stickers have. So because of this, I think that it is a very decent investment to make, of course, Navi is a very popular team as well, so I don't think you can go wrong with a Navi Hollow. Now, if you've noticed, I'm not mentioning any papers and any glitter stickers for you guys to invest in, and that is gonna be because the papers and the glitters look exactly the same as they do in the Antwerp 2022 collection. Most of these stickers are basically out for a very long time because of that. So that means like I wouldn't suggest you guys buying any papers or any glitters to invest in because I think that because they look exactly the same as Antwerp, they're not going to have that big of a demand for them. So I will stay away from the glitters and the papers for now. Of course, maybe something's going to change. But I would not be investing in papers or glitters because 
by this team, that means that the next major will probably have papers and glitters that look pretty similar to this as well. So that just doesn't give them that much of a longevity. But the hollows at least have different color shifts, so they can be a fun thing to invest in. But papers and glitters are stickers I would personally stay away from right now, at least as individual investments, because they just seem like they're gonna make the same stickers all over again for each major. So at least for me, I don't want to be taking those kinds of risks, so I'll be just staying away from them. Like for example, here's the Furia glitter that you can see right now from the Paris Major, and I'll show an image of the Antwerp glitter as well for Furia that looks exactly the same. The only difference is the Paris Blast TV 2023 in the bottom left corner. So with this being said, let's continue on with some other stickers that are pretty decent investments. I'm not going to be mentioning any golds because I think golds are a bit expensive and usually don't uh, give that big of a yield. But if you have some money, of course, I think that golds from popular teams are always a very good investment as they always get used up. So any popular teams that have golds that you like, make sure to get them if you have the money. But I'll stick to hollows right now in this video as I find those to be the most fun, unique things to invest in. Another very nice hollow I like personally is gonna be the Ninjas and Pajamas hollow. It has a dark blue shift to it, so personally that just looks very nice to me. I don't know if everybody's gonna like it, but to me this looks very nice. So I might get a few, but I won't be investing the same amount of money in this one as I'm gonna be investing in the previous two I mentioned, as I think that those look better than this Ninjas and Pajamas Hollow, but it still looks pretty unique and I think that it could be something special. So now I'm gonna go over one of my favorite, I think, investments that is gonna be the Greyhound Gaming Hollow sticker. It looks light blue with a red tint, similar to the Furia Hollow, but it is on the Greyhounds Gaming sticker. Why I think it might be a very decent investment is gonna be because Greyhound Gaming haven't been playing in any of the previous majors, so that means no borderless stickers for them, except now. So, it might be a very decent investment, plus they might not qualify for the next major, which will make their sticker very sought after. So. Very nice effect, I like the colors, it could go well on many different skins and I could see this going on very, very different crafts. So I think that the Greyhound Gaming Hollow is a very, very decent investment. Next up, I got something for all the Prince Stream lovers. So if you're using Prince Streams, maybe try investing in the Mongols sticker as those stickers I think look very very good on Prince Streams right now. They have a similar effect with the hollow and I would think that many people will be wanting to create crafts with the Mongols hollow and Prince Streams on them. So that's gonna be my last suggestion for the hollow investments. Now I know this video isn't anything very specific. I'm not talking about what capsules you guys should be investing in. I'm not going to be talking about all that strategy as I will be making a longer format video explaining everything that you guys want to know. But for now, a quick video. This was my first glance at looking all of these stickers and those were the five stickers that really stood out to me. So I really think that those stickers have something special to them. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm not. I'll continue looking at it, doing my research, and of course, I will update all of you guys in the later video that I make on the exact strategy I'll be using to invest in this major. So what capsules I'll be buying, what ratio of capsules I'll be buying, will I be buying any autograph capsules? So, yes. So, with all this being said, thank you so much guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like on this video. And also, if you have any questions regarding these stickers or any other CSGO investment, make sure to leave it down in the comments below. 
and I will answer you guys as quickly as possible. So, with all this being said, thank you so much for watching this video, and have an amazing rest of your days. Peace out, and bye.